taxing the wealthy has become a common call among some of the Democratic presidential hopefuls. Today, Senator Bernie Sanders released his plan, which would hit multi-billionaires especially hard. Here's Robert Frank. All right. Senator Bernie Sanders launching a new wealth tax proposal that would cut billionaire fortunes in half over the next 15 years. The plan follows Senator Elizabeth Warren's own wealth tax that has helped lift her in the polls. What we are saying to the billionaire class is stop the greed. Stop the greed. Stop the corruption. Stop stepping on everybody in order to make more and more billionaires. Sanders' plan would affect taxpayers worth $32 million or more, or about 180,000 households in the U.S. It's a sliding scale, starting at 1 percent, but quickly rising to 8 percent for those with over $10 billion. Jeff Bezos would pay about $9 billion in wealth taxes just this year under the plan, along with his income tax, property taxes, and capital gains taxes. Bill Gates would face an $8.5 billion tax bill, while Warren Buffett would pay around $6.5 billion. Now, the top 10 billionaires in the country would pay nearly $60 billion in wealth taxes just this year. The economists who advised Sanders on the plan estimate it will raise $4.5 trillion in revenue over 10 years, about twice the amount of Warren's plan. They said it would have no exemptions, be vigorously enforced to keep tax evasion low, and, quote, entirely close the gap in wealth growth between billionaires and the average American family. Polls show that more than 60 percent of voters, including nearly half of Republicans, support a wealth tax on the richest Americans. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Robert Frank.